Kicking and Streaming fans. Welcome back to our monthly extravaganza list of all the new upcoming shows on streaming platforms. This is our list for May 2022. This is Kicking and Streaming Podcast. Netflix, May 4th, Meltdown, Three Mile Island. This four-part documentary series tells the story of ordinary people having the courage to do extraordinary things. Meltdown tackles the 1979 near catastrophe at Three Mile Island nuclear power plant in Pennsylvania. Shown through the lens of the staff and the community it impacted, and it promises to bring viewers into the worst nuclear incident in U.S. history. The Pentaverate. What if a secret society of five men has been working to influence world events for the greater good since the Black Plague of 1347? As this new series begins, one unlikely Canadian journalist finds himself embroiled in a mission to uncover the truth and just possibly save the world. Created and written by Mike Myers, and starring him as seven characters, this comedy series has additional strong casting and the potential to be a total delight. May 6th, Along for the Ride. This film, based on the novel by Sarah Dessen, follows Auden's last summer before college, and she's spending it in picturesque Colby Beach. Insomniac Auden spends her time roaming the streets after everyone else is asleep. Everything changes when she meets Eli. On their nightly adventures, Eli challenges Auden to a quest to live out all her childhood dreams. Welcome to Eden. The latest foreign language TV series off the Netflix production line is Welcome to Eden, an upcoming Spanish sci-fi drama reminiscent of the likes of Lost and the Wilds. Are you happy? With this question, Zoa and four young, attractive social media influencers are invited to the most exclusive party in history, set on a secret island and organized by a new drink brand. What starts as an exciting adventure will soon turn into the trip of their lives. But paradise is not really what it seems. May 10th, Our Father. This documentary follows Jacoba Ballard, an only child conceived by a donor sperm who always dreamed of having a brother or sister. An at-home DNA test led her to the discovery of not one, but seven half-siblings, a number that defies best practices in fertility medicine. As the group set out to learn more about their curious family tree, they soon discover the truth. Their parents' fertility doctor had been inseminating his patients with his own sperm without their knowledge or consent. As Ballard and her newfound siblings realize they've barely begun to untangle his web of deceit, their pursuit of justice lies at the heart of this unsettling story about a deeply disturbing breach of trust. Operation Mincemeat. It's 1943, and the Allies are determined to break Hitler's group on occupied Europe, so they plan an all-out assault on Sicily, but they face an impossible challenge. How to protect a massive invasion force from potential massacre. It falls to two remarkable intelligence officers to dream up the inspired and rather bonkers disinformation strategy of the war, centered on the most unlikely of secret agents, a dead dude. Operation Mincemeat is based on the very true story of an idea that hoped to alter the course of the war by defying logic, risking thousands of lies, and testing the nerves of its creators to the breaking point. May 13th, Senior Year. Rebel Wilson's first project since her role in The Awful Cats is the movie Senior Year. This movie follows a 37-year-old woman who wakes up from a 20-year coma and goes back to school to get the full experience of her senior year that was unexpectedly cut short. There should be some intriguing themes behind its premise as the trailer seems to indicate a focus on the shift in high school culture over the past two decades, although through the eye of comedy. HBO Max, May 5th, The Staircase, limited series. Highly anticipated, The Staircase is based on the true story explored in the documentary of the same name. We follow Michael Peterson, played by Colin Firth, 
and his large North Carolina family, and the suspicious death of his wife, Kathleen, played by Tony Collette. This is a true crime thriller sure to intrigue those familiar with the real life story and those who aren't. Along with covering the death of Kathleen, the show will also dramatize the documentary experience which captured the story for a large audience in the mid-2000s. Peacock, May 19, 2000. Limited series. Fame is her destiny and Angeline is her name. Meet the blonde bombshell behind the billboards in the new original series, Angeline. Per an official synopsis, Angeline is about LA's original billboard icon from the 80s, who infiltrated pop culture and rose to fame when a series of billboards began to appear around LA featuring her signature curvy figure. The series also addresses fame, identity, survival, billboards, corvettes, lingerie, men, women, women teasing men, men obsessed with women, West Hollywood, crystals, UFOs, and most importantly of all, the self-proclaimed Rorschach test in pink, glow-in-the-dark queen of the universe Angeline, Emily Rossum, and Martin Freeman star. Hulu, May 6th, Hatching. In the finished production Hatching, a 12-year-old gymnast is desperate to please her image-obsessed mother, whose popular blog presents their family's idyllic existence as manicured suburban perfection. One day, after finding a strange egg in the woods, she brings it home, nestles it in her bed, and nurtures it until it hatches. The creature that emerged becomes her closest friend and a living nightmare. A fascinating portrait of the nature of maternal instinct it shows the battle she goes through to come to terms with the genuine bond with her grotesque and bloodthirsty newfound family while contending with the fraying connection to her own demanding mother. May 9th, Candy. Starring Jessica Biel, this five-night true crime miniseries about Candy Montgomery, a 1980 housewife and mother from Texas who seemingly had it all. A loving husband with a good job, a daughter and a son, a nice house in the brand new suburbs. So why did she kill her friend from church with an ax? May 15th, Conversations with Friends. After the success of Normal People, Hulu is adapting another one of Sally Rooney's novels, Conversations with Friends, as a miniseries. Conversation with Friends tells the story of two ex-girlfriends, now best friends, that cross paths with an older writer and her active husband ahead of their final year at college. What begins as an innocent four-way friendship gives way to secrets, affairs, and unforeseeable revelations. May 31st, Pistol. Pistol is based on Sex Pistols guitarist Stephen Jones' 2017 memoir, Lonely Boy, Tales from a Sex Pistol. The creators say that the show is about a rock and roll revolution, the furious raging storm at the center of this revolution are the Sex Pistols. And at the center of this series is Sex Pistols founding member and guitarist, Stephen Jones. Jones' hilarious, emotional, and at times heartbreaking journey guides us through a kaleidoscope telling of three of the most epic, chaotic, and mucus spattered years in the history of music. The six episode series is directed by Oscar winner, Danny Boyle. Disney Plus, May 20th, Chippendale Rescue Rangers. A comeback 30 years in the movie, the Chippendale Rescue Rangers movie catches up with the former Disney afternoon television stars in modern day LA. With a strong voice cast and a mix of CGI and 2D animation, this looks like it could be a fun outing. May 27th, Obi-Wan Kenobi series. The biggest arrival of the month on Disney+, Plus, and arguably the biggest, period, will be Obi-Wan Kenobi, which brings Ewan McGregor back into the role of the Jedi Master. It's Star Wars. Need I say more? Amazon Prime. May 6th. The Unsolved Murder of Beverly Lynn Smith. This Amazon original docuseries dives deep into the elaborate and controversial sting operation that was destined to investigate a suspect in the murder of 22-year-old Beverly Lynn Smith, but only ended up raising more questions and causing a search for justice that spans decades. 
Beverly lived in a rustic farmhouse in an industrial community of Ontario with her husband and 10-month-old baby. On December 9, 1974, she was murdered in the kitchen of her home. By 2007, the case had gone cold until the results of a polygraph test raised suspicions. May 13th, The Kids in the Hall. First premiering in 1989, the original Emmy-nominated The Kids in the Hall was a Canadian alternative comedy sensation that developed a die-hard fan base while influencing countless comedians and performers. The new season marks the return of the original kids, with eight new episodes featuring all new sketches. May 18th, Lovestruck High series. Lovestruck High is a brand new immersive reality dating show that transports 15 UK eclectic and diverse students who won't be going back to just any ordinary high school. They'll be fulfilling their teenage fantasies by entering the nostalgic picture perfect world of an American high school. The student's ultimate assignment is to secure a date for prom. Just who will be crowned prom royalty and win the $100,000 prize? This series will be narrated by none other than Lindsay Lohan. May 19th, Bang Bang Baby series. Bang Bang Baby is a crime drama series set in Milan in 1986. Alice is 16 years old and lives with her mother Gabriella in a small, boring, working class town in Northern Italy. Her gray and monotone teenage existence could not be further removed from the glossy images depicted on TV. Everything suddenly changes when she is confronted with a shocking revelation. Alice discovers that her father, who she had believed had been murdered years earlier, is actually still alive. To cope, Alice will use her imagination, influenced by TV, music, and the pulp culture of her time, which is the 80s. May 20th, Night Sky. Spanning time and space, the series Night Sky follows Irene, played by Sissy Spacek, and Franklin York, J.K. Simmons, a couple who, years ago, discovered a chamber buried in their backyard which inexplicably leads to a strange, deserted planet. They've carefully guarded their secret ever since, but when an enigmatic young man enters their lives, the York's quiet existence is quickly upended, and the mystifying chamber they thought they knew so well turns out to be much more than they could ever have imagined. And there we have it! All the fantastic new stuff coming to the world of streaming in May 2022. Which ones are you the most excited for? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe.